Jessica with Chapter 6 and today I'm here to talk about Ashes Ashes by Joe Trigiari. I read this book a while back so I'm a little vague on some of the details but basically what this book is about is a young girl named Lucy. She's around 17, 18 years old. Lucy is one of the only 1% of the human population that is still on the earth. Basically, it's just an over-dramatization -dramat of what people are saying is going to happen with all of the floods and the droughts and the tsunamis and the cataclysmic events and then also a lot of pandemics and plagues. Essentially, it's the end of the world and only 1% of the human race is still there. So Lucy is one of those 1%. She is on her own. She is living by herself until one day she gets chased into the forest by a group of hunting hounds. and she meets up with this boy who basically shows her that she does not have to be living alone. There's a little civilization of people nearby. Lucy eventually decides to at least visit this civilization, but as she does, she realizes that the epidemics and the floods and all of the cataclysmic events that are occurring are not the only dangerous thing out there. There are also people called sweepers looking for specifically her. So she has to figure out why they're looking for her, what they want with her, and she has to try to evade them, basically. I thought this book was so-so. It wasn't amazing and it wasn't bad. It, I think it had a very easy flow to it. It was very easy writing. Um, it didn't take me very long to get through at all, but the story wasn't as developed as, as well as I thought it could be. Essentially, the epidemic that happens, and I don't think imagine that this is a spoiler at all, is smallpox and it has to do with the people who are vaccinated for smallpox and all those things like that. I'm one of those people who I, I, I believe in getting vaccinations yes but new vaccinations and I think they're very dangerous because essentially a vaccination you take it and it's putting a little bit of the virus inside of your body so that your body knows how to fight it and that's how you keep it away from what my understanding of it all. So it seems super dangerous to be putting all these dangerous diseases into your body but obviously it works. There are some terrible side effects sometimes and in this case um, smallpox has returned. It was really interesting to read about that kind of um, end of the world scenario because generally the end of the world books that you read about today are zombies or things like that and this was just a, a real life, the world ended, nothing supernatural just scientific crazy stuff that's going on and it was that was a really interesting take but it wasn't interesting enough it was a great idea but I don't feel like enough was put into the story to really make me make it like hit home for me so while it was good and it was well conceived it wasn't it wasn't acted out as well um, I also felt the characters were kind of shallowly developed. I'm a big character person. If the characters, if I don't feel like the characters are real people, then I don't like the characters. So while the characters were so-so, it just, it wasn't amazing for me. It wasn't something that I consider myself absolutely having to read, but it was something that I am glad I got a chance to pick up. So definitely check it out and see if it is something for you. I am Jessica with Chapter Chicks. This is my review over Ashes Ashes by Joe Turiari, and I hope that you enjoyed it.